Spot on, nice fish. Perfect. Nice walleye. Look at that. Beautiful. Minnesota gold right there. Nice, Katie. <laughs> Love it. Katie, I'm an angler, a metalsmith, a mom. I'm Kendra, I am a therapist, an angler, a knitter. We have been friends for so long, and we always wanted to come to Minnesota to fish the glacial lakes. I'm so excited to see some of the city before we head north. How are you guys doing? Doing well. Ready for some good food. Just kind of build your own adventure here. You have to just pick a corner, and you just gotta make your journey all the way around. Yep. Thanks, Chef. One of my special talents is finding the most non-touristy places when I'm on the road. There's so much to look at here. Whoa. Amazing. Oh, this place is epic. Steven, right? Yes. I'm, I'm Kendra. It's so Kendra. nice to meet you. I love your sweater. Can you tell? I can always tell a handmade sweater versus a store. <laughs> yes, you can. Sure. Yes, I'm Katie. Okay. Nice Katie. to meet you. Katie. Welcome Steven. to my store. Thank you. It's good to be here. It's my firehouse turned palace. I'm like the collector, the museum of yarn. Okay. I'd been a corporate designer for 25 years, but I started as a kid with my mom. And so uh, I said, Mom, what do I do with the rest of my life? She's like, open a yarn shop. You know how to do it. It's what you love. Well, I'm in it 20 years now. So I've seen it and done it all. Yeah. You can see how happy I am. Oh, yeah. No, I, I get it. <laughs> my brain is exploding. That place was really cool. 94 west in about half a mile. And here we are. Hey, Hi, how are ladies. you? Hey. Good, welcome. Mateo. Yes. yes. How did this place come to be here? I always say this is the house that Jambalaya built. <laughs> My mother is from New Orleans, born and raised. My grandfather was a chef on a cargo ship that would leave from the port of New Orleans and travel all over the world. So some of these recipes on the menu are from him. Um, they got passed down through my mother. That's really cool. This is like top notch. Um, I never would have thought we'd be eating delicious oysters in Minnesota. I didn't, know, I didn't either. Wow. Here's to oysters in Minnesota. Here's to that. Cheers. This place is my favorite restaurant, always, of all time, ever. What a good meal. And there's still a bakery. I heard that they have lemon chocolate pie. What? Hi. Hi, y'all. I love spontaneous opportunities to check things out. I need more eyeballs. Wow, look how blue Babe is. The two figures remain permanent symbols of Bemidji and its most colorful era of logging and lumberjacks. I'm seriously so excited to go see the headwaters. The mighty Mississippi begins to float on its winding way, 2,552 miles to the Gulf of Mexico. Whoa, so cool. Turn right, then the destination is on your right. Oh, seagull. Yeah, there's another one. That's weird to my brain. <laughs> the scale is pretty epic. Very oceany here. Yeah. Let's go catch some fish. We're going fishing. Captain Cole, nice to meet you guys. Yeah. Where are you girls from? We're from the Carolinas. Well, this was a little journey for you guys. Glad to have you out. What's the main style of fishing in your area? Definitely fly fishing. We fish for the native brook trout in sure. the really yeah. small streams, yeah. There's so many different ways that you can fish. We come from the south, and we're coming up here, and we're learning something new, and it's something that we can take with us. The lake is so big, you feel like you're on the ocean. All right, just keep reeling. I'm going to reach up behind you and grab this scoop. Nice, Kendra. Scoop. Yeah. I like it. Nice fish, too. Here it comes. Awesome. Perfect. So that'd be a good eater walleye there. Oh, yay. Awesome. Well, as good as it gets. Fishing's good. Good fishing's good. Ooh, double and up. Double and up. Get a catch. <laughs> That's a nice fish if you can land that bugger. Oh. Nothing like just being out on the boat. We're like out there now. It was just so vast. It did feel very coastal. I'm excited. I want to go swimming. I feel like every time we go swimming together, it's in a really beautiful, wild place, and it's amazing. Yeah. It's a lot warmer than I thought it would be. 
There's something so beautiful about eating the fish that you catch. And your walleye was like this big, right? Way bigger than that. <laughs> This is definitely the most consecutive quality time we've ever had together, and it's been really special. Got it! <laughs> Our friendship was formed in nature, and it's, it's where we kind of belong. People in Minnesota, they're so nice, and they want you to have a great time and experience their state in a beautiful way. Getting up here and just seeing the lakes, hearing the loons, being in crystal clear water, and seeing nothing but green and blue, I felt like I was on a different planet, yet so very connected to where I had just come from. 1010 10 recommend. <laughs>